Hey everyone, this is Rascal, and um, I'm, well yeah, you guys can see the fucking post right here right now about the start of this video. I went to Anime North 2016 this year, and I'll admit something, this is actually my very first convention, I'm not kidding. Yeah, I've known about this thing for well over at least 10 years, I'm not kidding. And I've never went once, except for this year. And... I have no regrets. I really don't. Um, I had a lot of fun. I saw a lot of people in cosplay. Um, I picked up a few animes. Unfortunately, the original video I had put up um, didn't work out too well because the internet at the hotel fucking sucks. Um, now, the one thing I learned about convention, you're either going to pay a lot more than you should for the anime and stuff you buy than online or locally. So, if you guys ever plan to go to any convention in your, near your area, please be careful when you do so. Now, I won't be able to... Well, I'll post them in picture format uh, from internet clips. But uh, a few animes I got were Death Note, which is something I've been well wanting to get for a while because I did start watching it and I completely forgot about it and then picked it back up. Uh, no Game No Life. Again, this, these are animes I like. Uh, Guilty Pleasure actually is Chobits, I'm not going to lie. Uh, yeah. Another one is uh, When They Cry, or everyone knows that as Igarashi no Naku Koroni. Uh, the f complete f season of season one, anyways. Uh, this is one anime I really actually want to make my friends watch just to make them go, what the fuck? Um, Beyond a Boundary. I watched this. I binge watched Beyond a Boundary online. I have no fucking regrets. This that was a beautiful anime, and I loved it. And one other thing from well, I say my childhood. I saw maybe an episode or two, but I was probably late into the series. And that is Cowboy Bebop. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, finally got my hands on it. Now I'm missing the fucking movie. In the last thing I bought over there, which cost me a hundred and fifty fucking dollars, but well worth it. Is the Sananju version Ka. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, I build Gunpla. And I do not regret buying that. Hey, it's better than shipping and handling for $250. $150? I'll take it. So, yeah. Uh, now, I'm probably going to post a few cosplay videos along with this. I don't know how long this entire thing is going to last, but... Um, I did see a few good I see, Actually, let me rephrase this. I, not just a few, every cosplay I've seen was awesome, because even though I did not know most of the characters, I could probably say, wow, that is an awesome costume. First off, I've never cosplayed except at Halloween, and that's, you know, the day everyone says, oh, it's legal and okay to cosplay day, and let's not lie, it is. <laughs> um, cosplays are one thing I've always admired. Uh, people who cosplay, who do this one for fun at conventions and two as a living I've always admired your courage and your ability to do this because my fingers and my hands are not dexterous at all I cannot sew for the life of me but I will not lie if next year I no not if when I go back next year I'm not gonna lie I will go back and um I will go back next year and I will most likely cosplay um since I got a lot of tips and hints from um, one of the panels I went to, which was cosplay for guys. And this is something I've always kind of wanted to do, but I've never known how to do it. And these guys do it professionally. They do it constantly. And you know what? That kind of got me to finally say, okay, I'm going to freaking cosplay. This is it. I'm going to cosplay something. As of yet, well, I've already already chosen my cosplay, but I won't reveal that till my announcement maybe next year when I'm going. Now, if Anime North 2016 isn't happy about me posting this, or should I say Anime North isn't happy about me posting this video, sorry guys, I'm just doing this for fun. And if you really don't want me to post this, go ahead, sue me. i like to see you try. I know the Canadian well as, as well as you guys do. You guys technically can't sue me for mentioning you guys. Yeah, um, I, with all the new laws of uh, <laughs> people online going to sue everyone just because of something said or done. Yeah, this that fear for a lot of Let's Players like us, or anyone at all, is high. 
Like, when I say high, I mean really, really high up there. And I'm still afraid that most of my LPs are going to get taken down. And I'm going to get a freaking cease and desist warrant in my mailbox or an email. Whatever. Yeah, I don't care if it's snail mail. I'll still freaking read it and be like, shit. Anyway, so, yeah. Um, like I said, I had a lot of fun. And I do want to go back next year. And I, like I said, I want to cosplay next year. Uh, and that's pretty much it. I have these vid these photos that are being up right now i'm not going to mention these characters i'm just going to post them up and hopefully get a few you guys know will realize who they are if you guys spot yourselves if you manage to find this video and if you want me to take it down or say you should have asked i'm sorry i should have and i forgot but it was the hype of the moment i apologize please don't kill me i beg if you don't kill me <laughs> I really do. Please don't kill me. Anyways, yeah, that's my adventures at Anime North. Um, I went to a few other panels, the YouTube panel also. Um, I hope I was hoping to be, learn how to become a better YouTuber. Um, I did, to a sense. As in, get a better program than Windows Movie Maker. Yeah, no shit, but uh, we're not all... Ro not everyone is still living with mommy and daddy. I'm sorry to say this, but not all of us are still living with our parents or living with uh, with a roommate and paying half a rent or something. I'm paying full here, people. Yeah, and I don't make any money off YouTube. And I know some of these people make a lot more money than I do, so they have the ability to buy programs or, you know, rent out programs a lot easier than I do because they're probably a lot smarter than me. I'm not going to lie. I'm pretty much an idiot. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, the history of Monster Hunter. Yes, I am a Monster Hunter f player ever since Monster Hunter 4. I'm actually getting the pan the pamphlet that I got, f or the panels I went to. God, which other one did I go to? Yeah, pretty much it. I one I actually wanted to go to, and I didn't even realize it was there. It was a um, Star Wars panel. I'm not kidding. I wish. Uh, they were going to talk with new movie trilogy being released. Come talk about the films, the comics, the manga, the novels, and the games with us. The Force will be with us always. Um, I wanted to go there at midnight, and I uh, completely actually fucking forgot. <laughs> uh, actually, I didn't even see it. Uh, another one is what I actually went to is anime versus science. Yeah, comparing the science presented in anime against our current understanding of the universe, Gundam engineering, Pokemon biology, starship physics, and more. And trust me, that was a fun one because, holy cow, I didn't think that route would be filled out. <laughs> oh, it was filled, ladies and gentlemen, and a lot of good questions were asked. One guy actually asked uh, if it was actually possible to create a lightsaber. One of the people there, a scientist, actually said, yeah, it's possible, it's plasma. Just the energy source and the handle and the creation of it, uh, that's another whole thing for you. <laughs> you know. Um, since I'm French, naturally, I actually went to uh, Manga Facafun, or uh, French Mangas, which is what it would translate into, seeing what um, the French have translated yet to be even in English. And I'm surprised. I did look up a lot of the mangas mentioned, and I've still not found them in English, or even an anime. What other? Um, like I said, cosplay for guys, and I like that was the big one for me because that finally put this, you know, the nail, the final nail on the coffin, saying, okay, I got to cosplay next year. Okay, so yeah, I've ragged on long enough. This video has gone to almost ten minutes long, and yeah, um, nine minutes and a half actually. So this video is going to end soon. I happy to have went to Anime North. I do not regret it. And I want to go back next year. If you guys live in the greater Toronto area or anywhere near Canada and happen to go and you happen to recognize my face and spot me, don't worry, you guys will spot me because I will announce this around probably February next year that I'm going again. And I'm going to show off the cosplay. So yeah, if you guys manage to see me and manage to go, hey, come say hi. I don't bite. And um, yeah, if you want to take a photo, I'll gladly take a photo. Anyways, this is Rasco. Thank you for listening, signing out, and take care, everyone.